What's up guys, my name is Cody and I want to welcome you to today's video. Today's video is all about how to beat cover 4 in Madden 18. This is one of the most popular defenses that I have seen uh, this season. We're going to talk about how to beat it. So the cover 4, especially specifically from the nickel 3-5, through five, is uh, in my opinion one of the best base coverages in the game. And I wanted to go over some plays out of the pistol, um, or not the pistol, but the, uh, let me find the, the uh, Kansas City Chiefs offensive playbook. And we're going to show you a play we can use to beat the cover four. And you can use it out of, you know, a lot of plays have, a lot of, a lot of books have plays, but I'm going to go with the bunch wide, and we are going to use the play Z spot, oldie buddy goodie here. And basically what we're going to do is we're going to take uh, Des Bryant, we're going to put him on a slant route, and then we're going to take Ezekiel Elliott, and we're going to put him on an out route or an option route, depending on what you would prefer. We're going to motion Des to the left, and we're going to our first read here is going to be this tight end. This little quick flat play is going to do really, really good against cover four because cover four is a um, quarter flats. So that's, the, that's the zones that they're going into. And they're going to have a difficult time. You'll see this post route, though, actually does a really good job also at getting open against the cover four. Because of the route uh, tree that we have with the other players, you're going to be able to inside lead pass this route to Williams if you have time in the pocket. For some reason in this year's game, in my opinion, the pocket collapses rather quickly. Um, so you really need to kind of step up in the pocket and deliver the ball. Another thing that you can do, this is actually something I've tested, it works really well, is put the running back on a wheel route. If you put your running back on a wheel route, um, you can also hit him with a pass lead to the outside. Normally he's going to get a pretty good, uh, if, especially if they're going cover four specifically. And if they go cover four specifically, you'll see that this play uh, can be really, really effective if you time that passing right. It will work really, really well. So there's that. And then the other thing you have uh, is if they go cover four, you can normally hit this corner to Cole Beasley, but sometimes it's a little finicky. It mainly depends on the the way the players play it. So I wouldn't count on this route every time. But if you pass lead down and away, normally it is open for a possessing catch. If you guys want to learn more about the offensive side of the ball, I would recommend you check out my premium membership. The link is in the description. It's going to give you detailed ebooks. You got to guys have about six ebooks in that premium membership that you're going to have access to over the course of the season. And it's going to help you get really, really good at this game. It's also going to give you a one hour video each week, which we just sent out the video for this week's update. It's really, really good. It's probably, in my opinion, the best defense in defensive scheme that you'll have this season uh, from the New England Patriots. So you can check that out. Uh, again, that is in the description. But again, you have that wheel route. And then if they break down on the wheel route, you have this route to Terrence Williams. So this is an oldie but a goodie. Uh, the Z spot, haven't seen a whole lot of people running the bunch wide this year. Uh, this is something that I think a lot of people have missed out on. As you can see, the freaking Redskins though are just bringing it here in practice mode. But again, uh, you know, try with that quick read. I, I actually find that quick read to be very good. I actually use that out of some of my other plays. You also have the uh, deep post route, which, again, is really, really powerful. Um, you know, if you have a good catch and traffic receiver over there. So anyways, guys, if you're new to the channel and you enjoyed this video, I want you to leave me a comment. And uh, let me know what is something else that I can help you out with in Madden 18. And let me know your name and how you found the channel just so that I can meet you and welcome you to the team. Thanks for watching today's video. And like I said, if you guys really want to take your offense to the next level, be sure to check out that premium membership. It's going to teach you how to do things like you just saw as you get better at Madden 18.